Hello Mech Warriors, how is it going and welcome to another episode of Mech Warrior Online. Today it is time to play the Jäger Mech. I wanted to play a classic. I'm kind of inspired by a lot of Mech Warrior 5 Heroes of the Inner Sphere right now and I wanted to play the good old Jäger Mech 6DD. That thing comes with a good chunk of ballistic hard points and as you can see we are using 5 auto cannon twos today for some long range ducker. That's pretty cool. So as you can see we got 3 of them on the right arm, 2 of them on the left arm. Sadly you cannot really run 6 at the same time unless you drop all the armor of the Jäger mech and that's the thing that we obviously do not want to do. However, the Jäger mech got buffed slightly. It got more sight and more center torso armor now, so it is a bit more sturdier, which means that we can somewhat, somewhat run an XL engine. It's still not the best XL carrier because it doesn't shield so well, because it doesn't really have lower arms, so your side torso will be, um, you know, attackable from every angle, basically. But um, since I want to get a lot of ducker out, I want to have a lot of firepower here, I'm actually going for the XL engine. Take a high risk for high reward to get the high damage numbers out. The uh, engine is, by the way, pretty low here. We are only running a 225 rated engine and that's uh, bringing us to 56 kph. I wouldn't go any lower than that because otherwise you'd be a uh, turret and yeah, it's not so good. For that also, we need an additional heatsink on the mech, um, not in the engine, but on the mech because the engine only brings nine. You need 10 to make the mech viable. So we have to slap one more in here and the rest, as you can see, is just ammunition so we can fire as often as possible. The skill build looks like this year. As you can see, I was going for maxing out the cooldown so I can, as I was saying, just shoot a lot of uh, bullets at my enemies. And this is basically the, the only thing that we need here. We need firepower, we need survivability, and that's it. Luckily, we don't even need so much cooling. We have a bunch of heat gen nodes on the way down, but this is all we need to actually get us cooled down. We don't need anything in the operations tree. As you can see, I'm using magazine capacity for longevity because I don't really want to run out of bullets. Spoiler, I will run out of bullets in one of the games. Games, so watch them and see what's going on there. Um, but yeah, um, there's again no operations. We have 60% rated deprivation, double cool shot just in case and a UAV that could easily be swapped for an artillery strike as well because it's kind of a long range mech. Sometimes you don't really make use of that UAV because you're not really in the thick of the fight. So you don't even spot anything with it. So I think an artillery strike would be even a bit better than the UAV. But it's handy that uh, you can just um, you know tell your friends that somebody is pushing you. There is some light mech wolf pack on you while you are in nice outskirts position and dropping that UAV the people will see it on the minimap and then they might bring help maybe they won't but that's the build everybody I wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming now and if you have that don't forget to leave a rating it would really help me out as a content creator and now it's time to hit the battlefield all right first game of the day we are playing the HPG manifold we are playing uh what is that here domination and we had horrible spawn we're really really slow and uh, you can see my people are already running away but we have somebody on the high ground there we have a shadow cat overseeing us that's good MRMs and Rock fives on the cat. That's interesting. Nice catapult you got there, buddy. Would be a shame if something happened to it, right? So let's go over to the right side. Echo 4. I think Echo 4 is fine. Trying to meet up with the, with the bigger guys and hopefully no enemies will shoot me in the butt while I'm trying to do that. Watching over the low ground and as soon as I know that there's nobody there, we're gonna watch over here on the high ground and you can see there is a light mech coming. A raven. Do I want to go for it? I probably shouldn't because my, my defensive maneuvers are more important than my offense right now. So I should get out of Echo 4, 100%. Oh boy, oh boy, this is everybody. This is everybody and their mom already. But we have something like a firing line here, so that's good. This is very good. And there's somebody, I could see legs. There we go. Okay, just one shot. Luckily, he didn't hit me. Oh, never mind. Put a UAV up because that might be a good decoy for my enemies. Maybe they want to shoot it and instead, uh, you know, kind of abandon me. Why are you pulling back from this? That's okay, that's just a king crab. We can intimidate a king crab, no problem. <laughs> that works. So, oh, oh no, 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 no. That's a lot of damage from the left side. So I want to go over here, take some cover between the pillars. And as soon as those pop-tarts are coming up again, we have a problem. So I want to go over here to get a little bit more to the right side. But those enemies are all, all of them in Delta 4. Like all of them now. Uh, yeah, attack Delta 4 now, guys. Attack Delta 4. Ugh, I'm stuck. And that. This guy here, I think it was that, or was it a pillar? I don't know. Fox, go for the king crab, please. Fox, yeah. Okay, let's go for this again. Good old chain firing. Getting shot from the side, but it's okay. Here was Cyclops. Okay. So the important thing is, again, suppression for me. And we got the catapult under rotation as well. Keep up the pressure on them, but don't go down. That's the thing. Uh, and here comes the Marauder. Okay, why not Marauder? Why not? Oh, wait. Was I hitting my friend? 
I'm not sure. But they, they're gonna try to take multiple ramps at the same time, which is sport. So, um... Uh, stay aggressive, guys. Stay aggress aggressive. Ooh, cannot talk, even. Yeah, I'm gonna get a lot of damage here because I'm the one being aggressive. Uh, I'm the one showing up first. And, uh, yeah, I really hope that we can get things done here. We got that guy. It was a big risk that I took there. So it's all about the cockpit check here. Ultra 20s, you say? Okay. You got two of them? Okay. I got my small ducker. Okay, let's go for it. Santa Torso doesn't look great anymore, but we might want to get him. We might will. Okay. Ow! So, again, where is the aggression that we need right now? There's a guy. Look at this guy. Look at him. Look at him. Going for me. I see, I see, I see. I think I'm still part of this. Ah, whatever. Doesn't matter. It, that does matter! Get the ducker! Here we go. I really want to see if I can take that side torso. Pretty good. So, again, it's all about aggression. Target down. Perfect. Now, we have some light mags on the sides. Ah, uh, yeah. That's the Raven from earlier. Okay. Yeah, my, my side torso doesn't look great anymore. Ooh, and we ate that strike. But I still want to be in the fight. So, therefore, we're going to do it. Hello, catapult. That's a half-dead catapult. I'm gonna brawl with it now. Actually, no. <laughs> That's dumb. Let's not do that. Here comes the raven. Man, one shot on my side and I'm down. But one shot on his side and he's down. Um, should we go for the raven? Here's the cat. We can probably go for the cat. Let's go. Let's do it. I mean, we have some friends around. And the last two enemies are actually here. It's one over there to the left side. We're gonna go for that then. It's a timber wolf. Hey, Timby. How are you? Daka, daka, daka. Daka, 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 daka. Catapult is down, by the way. And that's... No, it's not the last enemy. The last enemy was the, was the light or whatever PPC guy, the light mech that was... No, never mind. We have a light mech here? That's not a light mech. That's a freaking marauder. And we couldn't get the kill. But we are down to 40%. Both of our side torsos are open. Center torso is open. We almost lost the weapon, but we are still in good condition. So we did it. We didn't lose anything. And we are still alive. And we, I think we get dealt a good chunk of damage here. Let's take a look. We got one killing blow, 11 assists, one kill most damage dealt with 761 damage done, 550 taken with nine components destroyed. That was the first round, everybody. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. Alrighty, second game of the day. We are playing the Alpine Peaks. We are playing Skirmish. Does it mean we're gonna go up to the India 7 high ground? Is that a thing? Because, uh, or India 9 actually, uh, because that thing is impenetrable. You can just go there and have a good time. But I believe it takes us a long, long time to actually get there and my team is pushing to the right side. And if I'm going up there alone and there's a light mech coming over, I'd be dead. So let's go ahead and, you know, just move with the team. Just go with them and see what we can do. We have 871 meters range, which is absolutely fantastic. This is actually hittable. You know what? We say hi to that guy. Uh, wait, we are not hitting. Or well, we are not dealing damage at that range. Now we do. Perfect. Just like that. Just gonna aim and shoot and have a good time. Boop. Boop. It's not really dealing damage, I know. <laughs> but it's, it's fun to do that. I should probably conserve my ammo a little bit. Okay, okay. Hey, we hit him. So, where do we go from here? Just gonna try to give that guy a little bit of a headache up there. Do you run an AC2 there, buddy? I don't know. I hit him once. <laughs> Man, long range shooting. I should probably conserve my ammo a little bit. You know, just a little bit. This guy is, I think, really running just an AC2. That's good. That's really good. Gonna try to destroy some components here early on. So, and now the Annihilator in the back. Bum, bum, bum. That's what we do. We're gonna soften up some enemies. But uh, we need to get a little bit closer to be more optimal in our damage output. Oh, he's re actually returning the fire. Thank you very much. So, what now? I'm too much up front. My team is all the way in the back. Do we want to fire here in the, in the cauldron? Is that a thing? I don't know. I am not feeling comfortable in my position. Again, I'm too much up front. But I could try to get high ground. Again, try to get high ground. Really hope that my team is getting a little bit motivated to come over here. But you know what? We're gonna go ahead and do it. We'll... Uh, I don't think we can take that one. Actually, my teammates are going all the way around. 
at the very least some of them are so let's go with them it makes no sense again with this mech to just go on a, on a single uh flanking maneuver uh alone that's the thing let's go up here maybe we can get an angle on the guy who is uh, down here okay there's artillery as well there's a guy all right we have a cyclops now oh you got some rocks as well or let's say you got some rocks i got some auto cannons what is that Bam, ba, ba, bam, ba, ba, bam, ba, ba, bam. My, my things don't jam, buddy. That's fine. But we need more people here to actually also absorb some damage for us. I want that guy down. So what are we doing against that? I'm gonna put a... Oh, there he is again. It's triple rock. Got it. I think we are better in terms of, you know, DPS here. He, he will jam soon. He will jam and then I'm gonna go in and I'm, I'm happy. Yeah, this is where it is. That, that's right, buddy. You overextended. You couldn't kill me quickly enough. Now you are dead. Dum -ba -dum, dum -ba -dum. Why is he not dead yet? It's a freaking Cyclops, that's why. There we go. We finally got him. So that's a lot of damage that we dealt. Heavy Gauss Warhammer. Ugh, this is not so good. Let's uh, help out against the Panther in the back? I don't know. Should we? Oh god, we are getting swarmed by Light Max. That's good. That's a kill. Uh, I should not go for the light mechs. Let's go for the bigger ones. Question is, high ground, yes or no? I mean, we have a friend here. What's up on the other side of the battlefield? I don't know, really. But there's a fight happening down here. So let's see if we can get an angle somehow. I like the spot. I don't like the spot anymore. Nope, 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 nope. That's a big nope. That's a flea. That flea is gonna eat me. Uh, but he's also a little bit scared. I'm gonna go down here. I need to be within the team cohesion and hide there. Hide within plain sight, that's the thing. Alright, let's go over here. Maybe we can climb that ridge? No, we cannot. We're gonna slide down. Alright. Again, it's all about support fire now from second line. And here we are. Okay, we didn't take any leg damage, that's perfect. And I think we're gonna, again, just be a little bit behind my friends. So we can shoot into the fights without even taking so much return fire. There we go. He's going for me. Okay. Guys down. What hit me so hard? Oh, it was the Bushwalker. Yeah. <laughs> okay, fine. Uh, but anyway, let's go. Get that guy. Ah, uh, you know what? Let's go with the Daka. Let's go with a nice chain fire approach. Six and one. Enemy uh, light makes behind us now. Hey, what did... How did he do that? Did you see that jump? He was moving in one direction and then turning around into the other. Uh, that was kind of weird. But hey, we are seven and one. I think... This is okay. This is fine. Enemy light makes are trying to go away again. I don't know if they can do anything. It was a good attempt going uh, into our flank and trying to get that one guy down. But I think at this point, they cannot really do much anymore. Man, I am actually low on ammo, which is kind of crazy. Let's try to get high ground again. From this position, it's kind of hard to tell, though, if we can get it. So, I know that I'm, you know, showing my back against my enemies, but I still have some back armor, so I might as well use that. Sure, a Jenner up on the high ground, as well as the other guys fighting something on the left flank. I'm gonna go with the left flank, I'm gonna try to destroy that UAV as well. Okay, UAV kill. The question is, are they going more to the left or are they gonna go more to the right? This guy is asking for assistance, but it's clear that the Jenner is there on the right side. Let's go over here, let's see. Okay, 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 so we're gonna brawl with the light max, we still have four enemies on the board. And they actually are getting some more kills, so if they continue doing their wolf pack tactics, they actually might... Not really fully come back, but, you know, get a kill or two. And uh, let's see if I'm one of them. Because at this point, I think we can go all in. This is it. Yeah, those guys are getting pushed. Let's see what else we got. There's the panther, there's the flea. Oh, you got lagged? That's unfortunate for you. Very much so. Panther is without weapons. Or without his big weapon. Oh, let's go with that. I think we can actually hit more if I go chain fire. Oh, they really want to go for me now. Sure. Here's the flea. Here's one of the fleas. Go for legs there. And we got him. Down he goes. And this is the last guy. We actually survived this so far. Let's see if the Jenner is coming back. And he will. Nice hit. That was the last shot there from us. But uh, little Wookie got a nice shot, I think, in his back there. 
Good job, everybody. We actually ran out of ammo here. So my early game poking, whew, that was the last shot at the right moment. We got three killing blows, though. We got eight assists. We got three kill most damage dealt with 850 damage done, 430 taken, and six components destroyed. And that, my friends, was your daily dose for today. That was the Daka Jäger mech. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to leave a rating. That would help me out as a content creator a lot. And if you want more like that, then don't forget to subscribe to the channel as well. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.